Well, now to Montgomery County. For years, a woman has been spreading random acts of flowering around the community. It all started with an idea from her mother. Trisha Gallagher's car smells fresh as a rose. Make that a lot of roses and daisies and more. My car always smells delightful. Trisha rescues flowers from plant purgatory. She got the idea several years ago with her mom, Claire Mohan, and a friend, Bob. And somehow the thought came to me to approach grocery stores and ask if I could pick up their day old flowers. Some said yes, and the Happy Flower Day project was born. Several times a week, friendly and anonymous florists fill her car. And then I just say, God, where do you want these flowers to go? Who needs them? And a thought will come into my mind, like an AIDS hospice, a nursing home. On this day, they're destined for Wesley Enhanced Living in Germantown. Hello. A lot of flowers. It's one of her favorite drop-off spots. Annie, I met you the other day. Trisha delivers the bundles of bouquets personally with a smile and a song. Happy Flower Day to you. I never give people just one. I remember the first time I even met her, I'm walking down the hall, and she was just like, hi, I'm Trish. Gave me a big hug. And she makes sure the staff get some, too. Take something home. You know what? The love you for that. Oh, yeah. Trisha's mother passed away in 2014, but Trisha kept the Happy Flower Day project going. Her grandchildren sometimes help. She estimates she's given away 50,000 bouquets and plants. She's always smiling and, you know, brings the happiness out of everybody. When Trisha started, her car was brand new. Now she's racked up 160,000 miles and counting. I guess I'm addicted to it. I always think, oh, I'm going to stop. This doesn't make sense filling up my gas tank twice a week. But I keep on going, keep on flowering. Such a great way to spread a little cheer. Mm -hmm.